In this lesson, we are going to talk about comparing fractions. What we're going to focus on today is when they have the same denominator. Remember, denominator is the bottom number. De denominator means down. Let's look at the fractions 2 sixths and 4 sixths. What I want to know is how are they the same and how are they different? Well, if you look, their denominators are the same. That means that they are cut up into the same exact equal number of pieces. And how they are different are their numerators are different. This one is 2 and this one is 4. Here we have two scarves that are the same size, except one scarf is 4 6 green and the other scarf is 2 6 green. And my question is, which is greater, 4 6 or 2 6? Just by looking at it, we can figure out that 4 6 is bigger than 2 6. But let's compare them side by side. We know that the denominators are the same. When the denominators are the same, that's when we have to look at the numerator. The numerator with the bigger number will be the greater fraction. So, 4 sixths is greater than 2 sixths. Let's compare this to a number line. Here I have one whole, and then I have 2 sixths and 4 sixths. Once again, their denominators are the same. They're all cut into the exact same equal size. But here I have less because there's only 2, and here I have more because there's 4. So once again, 4 sixths is greater than 2 sixths. Let's use another example. Here I have a whole, one whole, and then I have it divided up into eighths. There's six of them here, and there's five of them here. So the fraction would be six eighths and five eighths. Whenever the denominators are the same, it is the fraction with the higher numerator that will always be the greater fraction. So if I look, 6 eighths is greater than 5 eighths, and I can prove it by looking at my fractions. Here I have 6 eighths, here I have 5 eighths, and just by looking I can tell that 6 eighths is greater. Let's compare 2 sixths and 1 sixth. Here's my one whole, and I can see that the denominators are going to be the same because that is divided up into the same equal pieces. That whole was divided up into six pieces. Here I have 2 sixths, here I have 1 sixth. So I'm going to write that down. And when I look, I can see that the fraction with 2 sixths is greater than the fraction with 1 sixth. So 2 sixths is greater than one six. I can tell just by looking and comparing. In this lesson we learned how to compare fractions that have the same denominator. So remember when they have the same denominator it's the fraction with the greater numerator that is always the greatest. So three-fifths would be greater than one-fifth. Now it's time for you to do the guided practice with your teacher.